looking for ways to hype in your business. Sometimes you've been an entrepreneur, promoter, spiritual leaders, business people with the big shops, fashion designer. Hello, Tel Aviv. Good afternoon, and welcome to another exciting uh, edition of this program, 30 Minute with Stars. Coffee and love taste best when hot. <laughs> Tell you us if you are joining us at this hour of the day, you know you are joining us on the program uh, 30 Minute with Star over the number one uh, TV station. And we are broadcasting from a studio here in Meta Quarter, uh, Bameda, Cameroon. And just let you know you can follow us on the program on uh, on telephone number 675 just to be guests on this wonderful program. Or you follow us on YouTube on Top Entertainment Empire. And why not visit our Facebook? Facebook page uh, Toba Entertainment Empire and like like us and follow us live on Facebook and just let you know this program comes off every Sunday and uh, weekday so you can always be part of the program. In today's edition of the program, we are going to be having a uh, Clinton Graffy to tell us about uh, his career. So uh, so just stay tuned if you want to know more about uh, Clinton Graffy, who he is and what he does. So don't go away. But before I come back for us to take uh, our guest of the day, I'd like us to have this new release by uh, Tina, and the title of that one is uh, UT. Let's have UT by Vinyu Tina, and when I come back, we'll take our guest for the day.
Hello, uh, television viewers. If you are just joining us, know you are joining us on the program. Uh, 30 minutes. We start, like I do promise, uh, we'll be taking a guest for the day, uh, which is a uh, Clinton uh, graphite and b before we talk about Clinton graphite, I would just like us to talk about uh, uh, Vunutina and uh, you know uh, like they say the song that uh, is we are just from playing is a Vunutina that was released on the 6th of December if I'm not mistaken on, on the 6th of December I just let you know that particular soundtrack is already having more than 10,000 views on on YouTube so we can see uh, what it's up to and that is a UT. Uh, UT is a song that uh, try to talks about uh, God's intervention in, in a situation. So uh, we, we, we always have to put God face in whatever thing we do. So right now, like I said, let's move straight to our guest. Hello, Clinton. Hello, Tabo. Good afternoon. Good afternoon How are you doing? I'm doing great. Why, you look good? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> are you flat with me or what? No, of course. <laughs> he, 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 I can see a gentleman and you say I'm flirting you. No, Why should I flirt a gentleman no, like you? I, I've always been a gentleman. <laughs> well, uh, you are here to talk to us about uh, Clinton Graphite. Yeah. Exactly. So, what's Clinton Graphite all about? Actually, Clinton Graphics is uh, the name of my freelance de uh, graphic designing label, which is uh, known as C Graphics. Yes. So, C Graphics is the short form, and that's really the name. Yeah, coming from the word Clinton Graphics. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, why did you choose uh, graphic designing uh, out of the some uh, other many jobs that we have around uh, around us? Wow. Uh, thank you for the question. Actually. I went through a technical school, so it's so amazing that I'm into okay. graphic designing. <laughs> when uh, many most people who are into graphics are either people who have done computer science and so on and so sure, forth. Sure, sure. Yeah, but I went through a technical school and I did uh, sheet metal, metallic construction. Sheet metal. Sheet metal. So, uh, what's the relationship between sheet metal and graphic <laughs> design? <laughs> I know that has always been the question. Actually, I'm what uh, the the Frenchman say, polyva. That means I'm multi-talented. You're multi-talented, <laughs> yes. sure. Uh -huh. So, uh, even while I was doing the sheet meta in school, I was good in art. Yeah, that was, that was very, very clear. In fact, even my schoolmates can testify. While we're in class, during free periods, I would draw things on the board. I can even draw the world map, partition wow. it, give, name all the countries and their capitals, and everybody would be like, wow this guy you are wasting here i say, well that's just part of my talent so uh after my baccalaureate technique i decided to uh, further my studies in the sheet metal department but there was really no way because of the nature of the country and given that uh, we don't have uh, let's say direct english uh, higher institutions where one can really pursue that career so okay. it demanded a lot so I said to myself, but I'm not limited on sheet metal. I have other potentials in me, which I should definitely exploit. So I decided to really go seriously into graphic design. So I started by just normal Microsoft publisher work. Yeah, before. Okay. Yeah. Wow. So um, what kind of graphic projects are you interested in? Well, actually, I'm polyvalent in graphic design. I mean, I'm multi. That means I can do almost anything in graphic designs uh, and now there's something okay graphic design has two categories we have motion graphic yeah yeah well, I, was, I was about to ask that <laughs> yeah, because <laughs> because I, I was asking about the project i, I can yeah. do everything someone will be like ask, asking you, that. you can do anything in picture good anything static yeah yeah, yeah. images posters invitation flyers yeah. logos whatsoever those are static designs yeah so i'm into static graphic design i'm not into motion graphics so anything any project on static designs i can do them Okay, so far, uh, far long have you been uh, in the graphic design, and uh, what, uh, what what can you say about uh, maybe your mistake? What have you learned from your mistakes so far in graphic designing? Well, so far in my career as a graphic designer, I've learned a lot because from the onset, you know, I thought graphic design learning was, learning from your mistakes. Yes, learning okay. from my mistakes. From the onset, I thought that maybe graphic design is just like putting some things that are flashy and making people happy and say, "Wow, this thing looks nice," but along the way i discovered that uh, there is more of communication in graphic designs than just images that's why you see uh, a professional graphic designer can see something i've done and he tells me that hey this is very bad okay but, but the customer will be very happy and satisfied because it's glittering and you know shining <laughs> definitely <laughs> yeah definitely so i've learned that normally the first thing in graphic design should be what you are trying to communicate across and not what the people really want so uh what can you say about uh 
color management when it comes to graphic design? Good. That is a very, very vital aspect. If you don't know color management, you cannot be a graphic designer. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because co- graphic, the core of graphic designing is communicating and colors also have a message. Okay. Like, for example, if you want to do something for, let's say, someone has a, a label or a company that maybe has a link with royalty. Okay. And they say, okay, we need a logo. Uh-huh. You go and take green yellow and mix it together you have done a very bad job <laughs> sure, you have to sure. know that there are some certain colors that go with royalty colors such as purple gold and so on so uh-huh. you have to know how to manage these colors and know which colors to mix them <laughs> very, very important yeah. um uh, just let you know that you're watching the program uh 30 minutes we stars and uh, uh see on the uh, graphic designing i know uh, many of us have been enjoying uh the logo of uh of 30 minutes we start and a lot of person keep asking who did this uh graphic for us I just let you know this logo was actually done uh by uh cleansing himself that's cleaning graphic and he's actually here with us that's the person we are talking with right now he did the logo for 30 minutes we start so um he's here to share with us more of him so uh clinton yes sir. what can you say about um the, y- y- your goals uh when it comes to your career your career goals yeah actually as i did mention earlier in graphic design in graphic design yeah. yes uh i for now i i deal mostly with static design okay but my goal or let's say my dream is to get even to motion okay. motion graphics and not only any at the level of motion graphics but also at the level of developing all right yeah. then um looking at at a country and session where we are where we have so many difficulties so many difficulties especially for young people to to achieve their goals what can you say about your weakness and your strength when it comes to graphic design? Actually, uh, when it comes to graphic design, my strength is creativity. Okay. Yeah, that's a very vital aspect. Yeah. All right. You have to be creative and you have to always be focused and always try to be modern. Yeah. You cannot go and take something that was good in 1972 to give it to somebody. In sure. the, the times have changed. A lot has changed. Then as for my weaknesses, um, what I've discovered so far is that uh, I don't know if it's a weakness at all, but I, I trust people a lot. Okay. <laughs> and as a result, they have dealt with me. <laughs> very know. important. I've done stuff for some people and, you know, just like that, they don't want to pay you. And so, so for me, that's what I consider as a weakness. I don't know if it's a weakness. And, and so, what, so what have you done? to improve uh, well. your knowledge. No, to improve your knowledge in graphic design because I know you have been in graphic for almost te- five years or more. Yeah, yeah. yeah so, uh, so so far, what have you done in order, to, in, in, in order not to remain in the same position? Yeah, someone says, the day you stop learning, you start dying. Okay. Actually, I've not learned I learn every day. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. <laughs> I learn every day. That's why someone, uh, most of my customers can confirm that the things I did uh, for them in 2016 and what I did in 2019 there is a in fact there is clear difference yeah it, it can be confirmed by most of my customers it's very very clear so that's to show how I myself I always try to update myself because I know that the times are changing yeah so I try to ask myself that but what is current what I try to also see not only the Cameroonian uh, 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 perspective but uh-huh. the world yeah, uh-huh. I follow the designers in US and so on to also see what they are doing Okay. So update my yeah. Okay, so um, how do you handle criticisms? Critics? Wow, <laughs> I, I love. I, I know. I love it. Uh, those are things that uh, most people don't accept. Yes. Especially when it comes to criticism, most uh, a, a lot of young people, especially yeah. people who do uh, movies, graphics, stuff yeah. like that. Yeah. They, in fact, those who do uh, something for the public, they, yeah. hate, criticism. they hate criticism. So That's you, true. you ask uh, as creating graphic, how do you manage uh, criticism? Well, I love criticisms because uh, it actually tells me where I'm wrong so that i can see how to correct it uh-huh. yeah like for example i remember doing a movie poster for a certain uh, movie crew and uh, when they gave me that poster the kind of pictures they gave you know everyone wanted to build a poster and so i was like this is not really this, this will not go but in order to satisfy the customers i say okay let me try to say what i can do to mesh all of this together and at the end of the day after matching i discovered that it was not really good but the people love it the way it was and just for me to just for some people to come months after and really say this was nonsense <laughs> and uh, i do not consider it as any, <laughs> okay. as any trouble i decided to change from that time onward if someone uh, if maybe a movie production company comes to me that do us a movie but i tell them that i need three people on the front okay yeah all right that stands 
All right. Okay. Um. What, what, what type of print media? You have? I, I believe uh, apart from freelance, I don't know if you work in any print media or if, if you have worked before in any. Actually, yeah, I worked before uh, in uh, Photo Logona, okay. City Chemist. Yes. All right. Yeah, I worked in Photo Logona, and after some time, I moved to Destiny Prints at the uh, Chubo. Right. Yeah, so I've worked there as a full fledged graphic designer. Wow. Before entering into freelance. All right. 100%. So so what, so what, why do you choose uh, freelance designing? Okay, the reasons are many. Okay. Yeah, for me in particular, the reason why. I Welcome back. Uh, you are still watching 30 Minutes with Stars over here, number one uh, TV uh, channel over here. So, uh, like I said, we are moving uh, again to Clinton to tell us about some of his accomplishments when it comes to graphic designing. So, uh, Clinton, what can you say about some of your accomplishments when it comes to graphic designing? Okay, my accomplishments have been so great because when I started, I used to do work just for people in Bamenda, but right now, I do work for people who are in Douala, who are in Germany, like uh, a, a, a public, there's a certain online radio known as Apex Radio. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm, yes, I'm, not Apex yeah, I'm the brain box behind almost all of their graphics online. Wow, could yeah, So that is uh, really amazing. <laughs> and I've also worked on the movie posters. Uh, I've done some movie posters in town and many people have seen it, but they don't really know that uh, actually I did it and so on. So I've like the recent from Chinjoya, the myth, uh -huh. yeah, I did it. I uh, did some for uh, other production houses, which uh, I cannot really name. <laughs> yeah, the names yeah. Here in code, yeah. So there are so many out there. So that is it. I've done a lot. Okay. So Clinton, let's take one minute to discover some of your work. Okay. For ways to hype your business, sometimes you've been an entrepreneur, promoter, spiritual leaders, business people with the big shops, fashion designers, yeah, filmmakers, yeah, with the artists, where just a sing sing song, you make man shaku shaku shaku. 30 minutes with stars, we've got Prince Tobo on the table, come and talk about your business, oh. so the whole world will know you. Well, uh, Clinton, I must say, could you your jobs? Your works are great. Exactly. <laughs> well, I believe anyone watching us right now and seeing what you have done so far, I believe anybody would like to get to you to move a job, definitely. I understand. Yeah. So, uh, what what kind of uh, design program are you more comfortable with? Okay. Before I answer that question, I will also want to make it very clear that when it comes to graphic designing, it's not so much about the program. It's so much about what you can do. Okay. with the program because there are a couple of programs outside there for graphic design you have correct draw you have photoshop you know, yeah and I, I, I know of so many yeah. right yeah. yeah so which one are you more comfortable with i'm more comfortable with photoshop photoshop and correct draw so yes. uh any, any reason why you choose this one i i choose photoshop because it has a lot of features okay yeah it has a lot of features and correct draw. draw because it also has a lot of features <laughs> and correct draw is a master in large scale designs yeah, with Corredro, you can design something that can even fill up the studio. Wow. Yeah. Wow, wow. And that's great. So, um, people watching us uh, right now, Clinton, how can I get, how can I reach you? Actually, uh, you can get to me directly on my phone number, 675-878168. 675-878168. Or you get to me on my Facebook page, Clinton Graphics or C Graphics. You'll still get me on Facebook page. On, on Facebook and uh, you can also get to my website. I have a website which is already running www.clintongraphics.com 
actually the the website is is about 80 percent because i'm the one working on it myself okay, yeah wow. so but it's running already you can get some of my work on it so so you're also a web designer i told you my goal is to get to developing <laughs> web developing app developing and so on wow so, so i'm on my way up <laughs> you're a great man <laughs> thank you you're a great man clinton yeah Okay, so um, at the beginning of this program, we didn't get your full name, so exactly. uh, maybe you tell us your full names, uh, where you come from, yeah. and maybe a word to people who want to do graphic designing. Okay, I'm called Achiri Clinton Atta. <laughs> That's my name. From? I'm, I'm from Meta slash Bafucho. Okay. But <laughs> <laughs> For no, right? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, um, a, a, a what to young people or to persons interested in graphic designing? Well, if you are interested in graphic designing, I would like to let you know that you have to be very creative. Graphic design has a lot to do with creativity. It's not just so much about using the programs. You can have the program and you don't know exactly what to do, but your creativity is what will push you to the next level. Hello, dear viewers, uh, televiewers. Uh, this is where we draw the curtain of today's edition of the program, 30 Minutes with Stars, over here. And i uh, just let you know that uh, I would like us to end by visiting the, mass the Massacre Kid uh, dancing uh, the song, Shake Your Body. Let's have it and see you till then. Next week is another time on this same program, 30 Minutes with Stars. Bye-bye.
looking for ways to hype your business. Sometimes you've been an entrepreneur, promoter, spiritual leaders, business people with the big shops, fashion designer, yeah. 